Hi, I'm Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande has been performing for many, many years on stage. By now, she's created a perfect show and perfect image. But sometimes things are out of a performer's control and things just fail. Ariana Grande is, unfortunately, not immune to on-stage fails. Being in the limelight is not an easy life to live, especially when all of your most embarrassing moments get highlighted and shown on repeat. Then again, that's the life you sign up for when you decide to be a superstar. Ariana Grande is a queen of many things, from the high pony to show-stopping vocals to even mastering the art of fake tanner. But what else is she the queen of? Embarrassing moments. Ariana Grande has had plenty of slips, trips, and falls since her time in the public eye. Here is the rundown of her most embarrassing moments and her always adorable recoveries. Wait until the end to hear what Ariana deems her most embarrassing moment. Forgetting the words We've all done things we aren't necessarily proud of, but forgetting the lyrics to your own song? Yeah, that's gotta hurt. During Ariana's 2019 tour, videos surface of the petite pop star stumbling to get through a song she's sung thousands of times. Although to her credit, Ari does everything she can to push through the awkward verse and keep her fans entertained. Unfortunately, this isn't even the first time Ari's been caught missing a few words. Back in 2017, Ariana was caught on video forgetting the words to her most iconic songs. To her credit, we think she handles the blunder in true Ariana fashion. She smiles and just moves on. Mic drop. Literally. Most of us can only dream of drawing thousands of adoring fans. For Ari, this is just a regular day in the life. Unfortunately for her, that also means that thousands of people witnessed her embarrassing mic drop during the Sweetener tour. Luckily for Ari, she was able to catch the mic right away and pick up where she left off. We gotta hand it to Ari. The girls got great reflexes. The Lemon Ever since show business began, and especially in cartoons, people have been throwing food on stage at shows they don't absolutely love. This is a way to heckle and tell the performer, do better or get off the stage. But we haven't seen fruit tossing for a while. Until 2019 Coachella. Ariana Grande was hit with a lemon by a Beyonce fan. She was walking on stage during her opening song and the lemon hit her right in the chest. This made Ariana hit a sour note and she said, That's cause one of y'all threw a lemon at me. That's cause one of y'all threw a lemon at me. Fans were pretty upset about this. Even Billie Eilish's brother did not approve. He tweeted, If you throw a lemon at Ariana Grande, you're a piece of shh. That must have been one very loyal Beyonce fan, but we think even Queen B wouldn't approve of this kind of thing done in her honor. B is all about women empowerment, not disrespecting each other. Of course, Ariana handled the situation like a champ and laughed off the whole thing. Sound fail. Coachella was a rough one for Ari. During her set with her best friend Nicki Minaj, their in-ear monitors went out. Just FYI, in-ear monitors are what you wear to hear the band, the beat, and most importantly, your own vocals. If they go out, you're in major trouble. Imagine trying to hear your band over the sound of echoes and all the Coachella fans screaming. Yep, pretty much impossible. Somehow their in-ears went out completely. Nicki Minaj tries to power through the whole thing and keep her cool as Ariana keeps repeating in her mic, we can't hear anything, and there's no sound in our ears. Ari even attempted to help Nikki get back on the beat, but only to throw them both off even more. Yikes. Considering the in-ear situation, they still put on an amazing show as usual. These two best friends have each other's backs. But wow, Coachella, a lemon and no sound? We'll be lucky to see Ariana go back next year. What do you think? Bang, bang, ouch. Ariana Grande is notorious for tripping and falling while she's on stage performing. She tripped and fell on stage while performing Bad Idea in Tampa on her Sweetener tour just last year. But that wasn't the first time and probably won't be the last. In 2015, Ariana was on her honeymoon tour and well, it's not the same Ari we see today. She's a little less confident, a little more cautious. And that's the beauty of watching a star grow up. Ariana was performing Bang Bang without the rest of her girls Nicki Minaj and Jessie J. She goes to jump up to another level of the stage and her boot catches on the flooring. She falls down and slams her knee into the floor. Ouch. <laughs> Oh, my God.
But as usual, you can only tell because she's doing everything possible to keep herself from bursting into laughter. Her vocals remained flawless. She jumps right back up and goes on with her choreography on the other side. But maybe, now this is just a small suggestion, those boots seem dangerous. Maybe she should switch to a shorter heel. Playing with fire. During Ariana's Dangerous Woman tour in 2017, she had a lot of fire because that shows us that she is indeed a dangerous woman. But the problem with playing with fire is if you don't get out of the way fast enough, it's not fun anymore. Ariana starts performing the song Dangerous Woman as she comes up out of the floor on a lift. She sings her song while dragging around a mic stand, but unfortunately, the stand gets stuck between the stage and the lift. Ariana tries to yank it out while she's singing and doesn't even miss a note, but it turns out to be harder than expected and she has to actually turn around and pull it out as hard as she can. At first we were thinking, why bother, just leave it. As it turns out, that area would soon be overloaded with pyrotechnics that start shooting flames from the very spot the mic was stuck. Luckily, it loosened just in time and Ari got out of the way. Ariana and her mic stand would have literally been toast. Bye bye, shoe. Another embarrassing moment from the honeymoon tour is when Ariana loses some of her wardrobe. Don't worry, it's nothing scandalous. As the song begins, she struts out with her dancers, maybe strutting too hard and maybe with too much excitement. She accidentally kicks her shoe right off into the crowd and screams, whoa, my shoe, my shoe, thank you so much, oh my gosh. It's hard to tell if the shoe hit anyone, but those platforms probably hurt if it did. Thank you so much, you saved my shoe. My shoe came off when I saw it. Thank you, shout out to Lucas. Her fans hand her sky-high pump back to her and she slips it on, laughing as usual. It seems like maybe Ari's wardrobe department needed some adjustments. Confetti slip up. While Ariana was performing at the iHeartRadio Jingle Ball in 2014, she almost ate it. While singing her song, Love Me Harder, Ari slipped on some Christmas confetti. Although the slip was tiny and hardly noticeable, she stopped singing and said, <laughs> you almost died up here. Woo girl, I almost died up here. Ari, if you hadn't said anything, we maybe wouldn't have noticed. Each time Ariana falls, you can kind of see her life flashing before her eyes and she feels like she's really about to eat that stage with her face. Thankfully, she was fine and finished the song without problems. The show must go on, right? How would you handle an embarrassing slip like that? Singing over Mac Miller. On Nickelodeon's Worldwide Day of Play in 2014, Ariana performed The Way, which was usually a duet with Mac Miller. Apparently, someone told her that they were doing the rapless version, but they were in fact incorrect. She ended up singing over Mac's rap and told the audience, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, they told me they cut the rap out. She tries to jump back in and keep going, but the timing is a little off and the dancers are off. Ariana goes on to perform flawlessly now that she actually knows what's going on. Come on, tech crew, help the girl out. Her most embarrassing moment. So what does Ariana deem as her most embarrassing moment? Well, this may surprise you, but it involves a shoe, again. At only 14 years old, Ariana was performing on Broadway in the musical 13. Evidently, there was a moment when she kicked her shoe right off of her foot. But the best part about this mishap? Her best friend was watching the performance and the shoe fell into her lap. Her best friend Alexa saved the day by throwing the shoe right back to Ariana. When I was 14 years old, I was in a Broadway musical called 13, and my shoe came off while I was doing the opening number. But luckily, my best friend Alexa was sitting in the front row and it bounced into her lap and she threw it right on stage and I picked it up and ran off and put it back on. We think if we were Ari, we would just stop wearing shoes on stage altogether. They seem to only create more and more trouble. Which of these moments would you be most embarrassed by? What's your most embarrassing moment and how did you recover? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe to The Taco for more content like this.